started to fall and where were you how could i know you were falling to grabbing the wind cutting my skin but it's hard because i i'm falling tell me why i'm falling oh life's calling but it's all Hello ladies and gentlemen, Scary Tubo4 here bringing you another Minecraft Let's Build an Airbase episode. In this episode we are on episode 16, which is uh, crazy. We've made it really far in this series and um, we've done so much so far. It's absolutely insane and I gotta give a big thanks to all those that have helped out so far. And um, in this episode we really have a couple of new faces that have uh, made an appearance and are really starting to help out with the uh, airbase, which I'm super grateful for. So I'm going to go and give a big thanks to uh, Recon and Ender, which have both, uh, you know, joined on and are uh, basically helping. They've been doing a lot of work and have contributed majorly to this airbase um, in terms of this uh, little shopping center you can see that we have in front of us. Um, so big thanks to those guys. Um, if you guys did watch the live stream, this everything you saw in the time lapse was from the live stream uh, that we were working on it. Um, so you know if you haven't already, you can feel free to check out the live stream, and that kind of shows you guys a live, um, you know, kind of, I guess, uh, you know, real time look into the building process and us talking, hanging out, having fun. Um, but also it's a four hour long stream, so you may, you know you may want to sit back have something you're working on and have it as background noise who knows uh but yeah really cool um longest stream ever but we did get a lot of stuff done so you know it's really nice having other people working on the world really gives me the motivation and uh, the drive to keep on working on it so big thanks to those two guys and also uh trench fighter 8 did help out a little bit on the base or on the um 
the shopping center as well, so I want to go ahead and give him links as well. Um, anyways, let's go ahead and kind of talk about what we have built in this episode. So this is obviously just the first part. There's still a lot more that needs to be done around this uh, base exchange. Uh, but basically, you know, we got a lot done in this first part for it. So basically, uh, this is designed to replicate the kind of, I guess, Walmarts on bases. So they don't really have Walmart or Target on base. They have a, their own kind of brand. The Air Force and Army use a brand called Exchange which uh, this is an Army and Air Force base. So uh, we decided to go ahead and obviously use the uh, brand exchange. Now this, uh, basically this center, basically it's just like a Walmart, um, you know, has all the stuff you can imagine, sporting goods, food, clothing, electronics, all that stuff um, is what this store holds. And it all has as a discounted price and you don't pay taxes on it. So it's a really cheap and uh, or basically a really affordable way for military to get everyday items that they need to um, and that's basically what this is. Um, also next to it we have the commissary which um, I think is more of like a marines type thing. I know it's based, this is kind of based off a little bit of a, the structuring of a marine um, base that has uh, the commissary and a, their uh, you know department store next to it. Um, I'm not exactly sure commissary, I want to say it's more kind of geared toward um, military gear um, in a sense, so uh, I would imagine maybe like shoes, or sorry, boots, um, you know, and all that kind of equipment there, boots, uh, ADUs, stuff like that, I don't know. Um, but yeah, that's what, uh, that's probably going to be over there, uh, more of a kind of equipment shop for troops. Um, and this one over here is kind of more your... Uh, buying groceries and stuff like that. So um, overall really cool. Um, this building here is has a garden center. So we have a little garden center here as we will have on base housing. You know, we have a little garden center outdoors. So maybe some barbecues being sold here. Uh, stuff like that you can pretty much expect to be in there. Um, then we have a few little shops here. So these little shops kind of pop out here. We have a Hertz, which is basically a car rental, which makes sense to have on a base as, you know, some troops being stationed there for a little bit, may need a car to get around the area. And then we also had a Starbucks that was going in here, but unfortunately with, you know, the, with a problem we had on the server, which basically had a lot of progress rolled back. So we did have um, some more progress done on this section that I wanted to show you guys, but unfortunately we had a problem with the server and we had to roll back it um, about 24 hours. So we lost a um, pretty good, decent amount of progress that Raycon and Ender did and uh, myself as well. So unfortunately we lost that. However, we did, um, you know, does, we can easily rebuild and maybe even do it better. So over here, basically there's going to be a Starbucks. Um, as we move our way down, uh, we have the main entrance here for the exchange. And this is obviously just gonna be a huge department store with, you know, everything, everything you think of a department store. You think of a Costco, you think of a Target, a Walmart. That's basically what they got going on there. As we work our way down, uh, we have uh, a little subway and I actually love this like subway. It's just tucked in here in between these buildings and it has all these little um, kind of triangle shaped awnings that go over it, which just look absolutely fantastic. Create a nice little shaded area. We're gonna have like little tables and stuff like that for people to sit and eat. Um, but it's really just a nice little area, kind of a little fits in this spot nicely and just, you know, just looks really nice. A really nice, really clean. And uh, the subway did have full interior. Um, Ender worked really hard and made a full interior for it, but unfortunately, uh, with the roll, rolled getting uh, rolled back, we uh, lost that. So uh, you know, forgot the way from do the interior again. Uh, but it looks really nice in here. It's really nice, uh, really, really cool. And I think the lights actually work as well. I'm trying to think of. I think there's like a lever back here you can flick, and the lights actually turn off. So he's actually got working lights in here. So um, he really does like and do doing interior. So hopefully he'll do some more on the base. And I think we're gonna, he's going to focus in on some of the restaurants and stuff. So that should be pretty cool stuff there. But yeah, subway looks really nice, tucked away in that in between the two buildings here. As we go over here, we have the commissary, which this building was a lot more finished, um, but unfortunately with the rollback, as I mentioned, we did lose all that progress. So this is pretty much all we got here um, for it. So you'll probably see a lot more done on it in the next episode. Um, anyways, uh, we move over here. Uh, we have the parking lot, which basically is pretty standard. Recon pretty much did a good majority of this. So uh, big thanks to him for getting this parking um, lot set up and kind of the plans from going here is uh, obviously finishing the shopping center But there's also going to be a gas station here along the say as well as a self-service car wash uh, So that obviously people can wash their cars um, But we also have the gas station which is gonna be on the street corner here Which is kind of a good 
place for it right on the chunks in here connect it up to the parking lot of the main you know shopping center so uh pretty good stuff there we're gonna have that we're gonna have that gas station there it's probably gonna be an exchange brand um as well and um also we're just gonna continue along with this road that's gonna go all the way down we did have this all finished and done but unfortunately with the rollback obviously we lost that but yeah the road's just gonna go all the way out here to this point we're gonna have a junction or a intersection and a road that runs down this way and flows all the way back uh, and then in this area right here i think we're gonna start to get into maybe some of the um dormitories um i'm also thinking of you know starting to get into maybe some like the maybe like a little park um you know some various little things here and there just to kind of create a you know nice living area for the troops uh obviously uh you know being so close to the huge shopping center and a few restaurants and this kind of commercial area of the base i definitely want to have some kind of living quarters or some kind of uh barracks or dorms or something near it so that's kind of the plan there that's what we have going on for us and um i think all around it's going to be really cool and look really nice in the end once we get this whole area set up uh but so far really great work going on the exchange unfortunately we don't have any really anything else to really cover regarding it as it's pretty much just a big hollow shell at the moment um and still requires a lot of detail and the back is you know very lacking in that um, so we're, we can definitely expect to see multiple parts. I'm going to try to break it up though so you guys aren't seeing the, you know, this exchange constantly over and over again and kind of keep it as a treat, you know, as we slowly work more and more on it um, while also doing other things. But anyways, thank you guys all so much for watching this video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys have any ideas or any, you know, um, you know, critiques or anything like that for the base, be sure to let us know down in the comments below. Uh, we look forward to hearing your suggestions and stuff like that as we continue to know we continue to work on the space and continue to improve it and make it better um but overall i look forward to seeing what you guys have to say about it and um again big thanks to those guys that have helped out and to everybody that's helped out so far on the base um other than that that's pretty much it for this video thank you guys all so much for watching as always don't forget to like comment and subscribe this video to before and i'll see you guys next time